uh, night five. Good morning. <laughs> How about some coffee? I want to tell you a quick story. Uh, your comment was, uh, this comment was on, I think it was on Federal Films Call Out video. Yeah, it was. And uh, I mentioned freedom in that uh, video a couple different times. And you said, uh, how much freedom does a bottle of Captain Morgan spiced uh, rum buy me? Um, and it reminded me of a story, so I thought I'd share it. What is it, amazing dog? All right, so uh, a friend of mine was getting married, and he wanted to have his uh, his bachelor party out on this island. It's a really awesome island, too. It's very, very tiny. Um, and sometimes high tide comes up and pretty much removes all the beach, and you pretty much have to squat in the trees. Um, so, uh, you know, they're getting out there by power boats, and they're like, just let us know what time you're going to be there, and I'll come get you. And I'm like, no, I have a, I have a boat. I'll get us out there. And I was taking, uh, I was taking three other people. I have, a, I have an 18 and a half foot uh, canoe. And uh, I'd never had that many people in it. And I never, it was out on the Columbia River, which is a huge river. Uh, Keila, you're going to spill my coffee. Um. And uh, I decide we were all working at uh, this one bar, and I decide after we get off work, so at like 3 a.m., um, we'll drive out to uh, the boat launch, uh, which is uh, uh, upstream from the river. It's actually a longer trip, but I figured we'd have the you know the current to go with us. Um, and uh, I ask everybody, I'm like, have you done any kind of canoeing? And, and no one had, and I actually hadn't done that much canoeing either. And, uh, so we, uh, we get out there, we drive at night, um, you know, we didn't have that much to drink, you know, I, I don't think I had anything to drink, um, because I was, you know, I wanted to make sure everything was sorted out correctly, you know, that, you know, I didn't, I didn't want any mistakes. So we get out to the river, and, uh, it's pitch black there, it's in the old, it's like old growth forest, um, park our car in this dirt lot. I couldn't even, I couldn't find, you're supposed to pay. I was I could, too dark. I couldn't even find where I was supposed to pay. I left a note on the car saying, I'll, I'm going to come back and pay. <laughs> I'm sure they, I'm not sure how many of they, those they see. Um, but we throw the boat in the water and start taking off and, uh, start paddling out a little bit and, uh, it really strikes home how gigantic that river is. It's huge. And, and it moves. It moves fast. So we start going through the, uh, the Columbia River Gorge National, National Scenic Area. Is it national? I don't know. It's beautiful, though. Um, like high, craggly cliff, cliff faces with valleys uh, descending down inside them. And... Um, the uh, the boat's really starting to move, like it's uh, like that eighteen and a half foot boat is just swinging all over the place, and uh, at one point in time, uh, it's just now starting like dawn's just now starting to hit. So yeah, well, I could actually now see the person in the front of the boat, and at one point in time, uh, it's starting to get so wavy out there that the boat rises the guy up in front so high that as he swings his paddle. It misses the water completely. He's so high off uh, up in the air uh, that his paddle can't even touch the water. So it's crazy, and uh, I was just starting to feel a little, uh, a little concerned when uh, the guy up in front, being just probably not even getting motion sickness, more like elevator sickness, um, breaks out a thing of Captain Morgan's uh, spiced rum. Uh, cracks the cap, spills some down his throat, and hands it down the boat. And so this uh, this bottle of Captain Morgan's just starts working its way around the boat. And so, like, we were all pretty nervous, actually. Um, I mean, things were off the hook a little bit. Things were getting near off the hook. Um, water was coming on, coming on board. Not much, but a little bit. Um, and uh, right as, like, the Captain Morgan's rum just started hitting my gut, and I just started feeling the warmth 
spread through my body. That was right when the rays of the sun um, made it up over the, the, the mountains and the horizon and shot down into the gorge. And so for like, imagine like uh, you're going through this valley and you look off to the sides and the side valleys, uh, so they open like this. And so as the sun shines through here, it lights up this face. This face is pitch black and then it lights up this face. And so every valley is half brilliant green light and half pitch black. And uh, just kind of paddling and looking down into these valleys as they slowly lit up and revealed themselves. Um, and almost kind of a checkerboard of black and green on either side. Um, and then the wind started picking up um, and the river started kind of like racing. Um, and uh, like so suddenly we weren't bucking as much as just hauling um, down this just massive river. I mean, they have uh, um, sea vessels come up there, uh, like big tankers, um, big ships come up there. Um, and uh, we, f I don't know, I think we might have come close to, I think we might have finished that bottle between uh, the four of us. Um, and uh, so we come, we arrive at the island and we, can, we hit the beach and come popping out. Uh, just raging pirate drunk and there's all these guys first thing in the morning uh, drinking their spiced coffees too uh, and they're like it's just they're they're they were impressed and uh, like not, not only because like you look out and just see the water is just kind of going crazy but like we came off the boat like soaking wet but like absolutely re relaxed and happy which is kind of like the thing it's like you kind of expect people to like show just a little bit of concern from coming through water like that, but the fact that everyone just kind of got out of the boat as if, oh, this is how I, this is how I wake up every morning, with uh, waves of fresh water splashing across my face, um, my hands gripped tight around a paddle. So, uh, yeah, it was, it was good, and it wouldn't, I don't, it wouldn't have been that good if it wasn't for that uh, Captain Morgan. I feel sure. All right, night. Uh, thanks for uh, having coffee, and uh, I'll see you in the tubes.